We're going to talk about materialistic aspect of life now. If you judge and criticize people for not having money or for not having fat pockets, you are a fool. Okay. If you judge and criticize someone because they don't have a good enough job than you do, or if you have more materialistic possessions than the other person and you want to criticize and ridicule and judge them, you are stupid. Okay. In the future, men and women will not be praised for how fat their pockets are or how much money they have in their bank accounts. Instead, in the future, you're going to see people being very much loved and respected and praised for how big of a heart they have. Okay? I'm telling you that in the future, people will no longer be praised for how fat their pockets are and how much money and materialistic possessions they own. But instead, people are going to be praised and respected for how much love they can give others, for how big of a heart they have for others, and for how much they can love and use their love and their high vibrational frequency to better themselves and others. Okay? So don't ever judge anybody because they don't have what you have. Don't ever persecute or ridicule someone because they are lower than you or because you think that just because they don't have as much money that you have or they don't have the same job that you have or they don't have the same car that you have or they don't have the same amount of uh, materialistic possessions that you have, don't criticize that person because this life and what we have to do here has nothing to do with materialistic possessions, but instead... Everyone is brainwashed into thinking that those are the things that are important. Wrong. You see all these rich celebrities committing suicide. You see a lot of rich, very wealthy rich people, movie stars, musicians, actors, actresses. You're seeing a lot of them very miserable. Okay? Knowing this information, you want to ask yourself, how can someone that is so famous, how can someone that has so much money be miserable and sad? That's because the main priority is not to grow your materialistic possessions or your bank account. The main priority is to grow your heart and your soul. People don't understand this yet. Some do, not everyone. Once again, if you judge or criticize someone for not having the same job or not having as much money as you have or not having the same materialistic possessions you have, you are stupid. If you judge somebody for not having the same amount of money that you have or the car that you have, you are a fool. So, get away from the material side of things. Get rid of the materialistic sense of life, because this is not going to grow your soul. This is not going to grow your heart. This is not going to give you self-love. This is not going to give you respect for others. And now, we're starting to see the catalyst of that. The catalyst right now, the catalyst for love and for high frequency is the opposite, is the hate, it's the anger, it's the persecution, it's the criticizing, it's the judging. So because of the brainwashing and indoctrination in our society, it's created a catalyst to in turn then wake the people up to a reality that compassion is the most important thing. And this mess that we're dealing with right now, the situation in our world that we're dealing with right now, is the perfect catalyst for that. 
all of the segregation, the hate, the anger, people are going to realize that it's the media doing the brainwashing and indoctrination and that it's governments and the leaders today that are brainwashing the mass populations of people and people are going to start to realize that the materialistic life is not important. Conscious endeavors.